Happy birthday, Roll Dog. Happy birthday, Roll Dog. Happy birthday, dear Roll Dog. Happy birthday to you. Happy, happy birthday. This is your birthday song. Happy, happy birthday. It is a very long... Hey. That's my boyfriend for you. Mm -hmm. He's very good at this. Anyway, it's like 4 o'clock in the morning there, so it's 1 o'clock here, and I wanted to call you right at midnight, but we were slammed at work, and there was no way I could stop what I was doing to call you, like, at all. I have no Adderall. My mind is, like, fucking somewhere else. I don't, I think someone shipped my mind off to Montana. I don't know. There's a huge crystal meth problem there, but that's for another day, another conversation. No, I'm serious. Look it up. You can Google it. I'm not even kidding you. It's really, really, really sad. Anyway, um, happy birthday, Roll Dogs. You are officially 30 years old. Dirty fucking 30, okay, bitch? I... When I tell you that your life is just going to get better and better and better from here on out, I'm not kidding you. Being 30 is such an empowering age. There's something different about it. There's something fun and exciting about it. And I've been waiting to tell you this for seven fucking months, bitch. Seven. Here, look. Let's count it. One, two, three, four, five, six. And also, look, seven. It's just wonderful, and I'm so excited that you've made it here. Like, I'm so excited that we've been friends for all this time now. Like, I couldn't possibly imagine not being with you right now, and I know that I'm not with you. And when I got your text the other day when you said my birth your birthday's going to be nothing without me, like, there with you, I was there with Drew, and he kind of said it was unfair of you to say, and I do agree with him because it kind of is unfair, but at the same time, like... It brought me to, like, immediate tears, and I, like, covered my face, and I was crying for, like, a half an hour to him, because, like, I miss you, and, like, you're my best friend, and I would do anything for you, and, like, you and Anthony are, like, the two people that mean the most to me out of all my friends, and I'm brokenhearted that I can't be there with you on such a milestone birthday, but you know what? We've had to spend a lot of our birthdays apart, and they've always been for good reasons, but I think from here on out that this is probably going to be the last time we'll ever have to spend our birthdays apart, so, and that's positive, that's happy thinking, so I hope that this is the best year of your life, because 30 has been the best year, best year of mine, and you have made so much fucking progress since you split up with Whatever his name was, I know you know I remember, but honestly, like, no. <laughs> no. He can go. So, I have a little package that I've been wanting to send out to you since, like, Valentine's Day. I'm going to rip it open, and I'm going to fill it up with a few more things. And I'm going to send it to you, and you are going to be so happy, and it's going to inspire you, and... Hopefully within a few months you were out here living in my apartment with me and it'll be the Roll Dog Palace like it has always been and like it always should be and we were going to live our happy lives and I sent you the photo today about Sacramento and the statewide unemployment rate dropping to help inspire you so you can move your fucking ass out here and trust me when I tell you that don't worry about bringing money or a lot of stuff. You can get it later. I've got everything we need. And you will be happy and satisfied and have all of your necessities met. It's a lot easier here than it is there. So hopefully now that you're 30, you're a grown-ass woman, you're going to be willing to fucking finally trust me after a, more than a decade's worth of friendship, after all the shit we've been through, hopefully you finally fucking trust me to just come out here and be with me and be roll dogs, and be happy, and live your fucking life, and finally make the progress that you deserve to make, and that you should be making, because you're being held back there, and I'm here to tell you, like, you have to trust me, I know you have trust issues, so do I, but if there's any one person on this planet you should trust, it's me, me, your roll dog, we made a fucking commitment, so get your ass out here, my friends are ready to be buying you a plane ticket the moment you're fucking ready. So let's do this. Let's make this happen. You're going to come here. You're going to stay here. And you're going to be so fucking happy here. Ready? Happy fucking 30th birthday, Roll Dog. I love you and I miss you.
Mwah. Say good, say happy birthday. Happy birthday.